Hey, it's Brickzar, and today I'm going to be looking at a new printer that we have. It's a Canon wireless print copy scan fax thing. It is the Pixma MX452. Don't ask me how much this thing costs because I don't know. I got this for free, and I've been needing a new printer uh, for doing some color printing. My color printer is a Samsung CLP 600N or something, it's a piece of junk. Uh, so I wanted to try a new one. I don't do a lot of color printing. I want to see how this does, and plus since this, you can copy easy with this, hopefully, we're going to try it out. So let's open this thing up. Hey, it's pretty out. So let's open this thing up. Alright, here's how it's all packaged up in there. So we got to get all this stuff off and get this thing set up. And we'll come back to you and I'll tell you if it was easy to set up. All right, we got it opened up. You had to remove a lot of the, uh, you had this orange tape and stuff all over it, protecting things pretty easy and straightforward. You got a big, gigantic instruction manual that shows you what to do. Comes with the color cartridge and the black and white cartridge, probably low yield. You got a phone cord and a USB cable and a power cord. It says to hook the power up before you hook up the USB, so I'm about to do that. All right, after you install the ink cart cartridges, which is pretty easy to do, it comes to this menu where you got to set up your wireless LAN. And see if it's got my access point. Let's see if this thing works. Standard setup. Yay, there's my wireless network so I'm gonna set that up all right my password has alphanumerics in it so it starts off it's already on the alpha and then when I got to where I had to enter numbers you have to hit the star key it doesn't really say that on there you can also have symbols here but you gotta hit the star key to get the number pad to go from letters to numbers now I'll see if this thing connects fail to connect all right, I think it was a problem with my my router, but I got it working. So I'm now going to do a test page. See if this thing works. And when I uh, got it going, it was already recognized by my computer. But now it says printer not responding. Oh, there it goes. Let's see if this thing will print. This is the very first thing I've ever printed with this. And paper loads in right there. I'm printing a color sheet. Oh, it comes out down here. You load the, the uh, side you want printed. You load it uh, face down. Not bad, that's a full color print. So pretty good. Alright, I'm printing out some Lego instructions. See if it uses all of my cartridge. It's a 48 page instruction book. And one thing I notice is it's printing them in reverse order. I'm printing all the uh, odd pages. It started with the higher numbers first. I don't know what I did. I'm glad I... I don't know if this does double-sided printing or not. I don't think so. So as far as printing, it's pretty straightforward. It was real easy to, to set up. And it looks like the other features, the scanning and everything, is just it's pretty simple. I'm not going to do it because I don't have any use for faxing right now. But... Um, Seems like it's an easy printer to use and scanner, so if you have any questions, you can ask me and I might try it, but I'm, yeah, I think it's um, good enough for me. I've used about half of the ink, ink cartridge in printing this book that's 48 pages long, so uh, the starter cartridges they give uh, aren't going to print a lot of pages, so I will be looking at getting cheap refills somewhere. Anyway, thanks for watching this video with a Canon Pixma 
MX452 wireless printer. Seems to be easy enough to set up. Thanks for watching.